This is my review of the Explore Scientific Toilet One Mount. I've had this mount for almost three weeks now. Um, the mount itself is mostly made of metal. Um, the legs are stainless steel, mount heads aluminum. Um, the only non-metallic parts would be the rubber the rather tipped feet, which you can see it here, the black uh, portion there, and the knobs and the handles. These are pretty much only the only plastic parts. The mount weighs uh, almost 17 pounds or 8 kilograms. Uh, you can find more detailed specs on the Explorer Scientific's website. And it's almost about 53 inches high when the legs are fully extended. I didn't fully extend it so I can fit as much as, fit as much on the screen here. Um, overall it's pretty good. The only problem I guess I find with a very minor issue is on the when adjusting the altitude. If um, you have it kind of angled, kind of pulled down, like your hands kind of resting on it, and you try turning, you'll notice that in the viewfinder, you notice that the uh, telescope doesn't it, it, it doesn't really move. If you try to keep it as straight as possible, then it works fine. Um, I guess the other thing I would like to have seen on this mount is uh, a bubble level. So if you're out like uh, in a field somewhere you will tell if your mount is level or not, since it is an alt azimuth mount. Right. Um, the tension plate at the bottom here has two one and a quarter and a one two inch holes for your eyepieces. And also uh, this mount is exact same as the Orion Versigo 3. Uh, so it just depends which you prefer, if you can get one or the other at a cheaper price. It's this exact same mount. The only difference um, is the Orion gives you a one-year warranty. Well, Explorer Scientific, as long as you register within 60 days, it's a lifetime warranty. Um, overall, I like this mount. Um, it's very good. If you can get a good price, it's uh, worth it.